Cystectomy Procedure Method Cystectomy is a surgical removal of all OR part of the urinary bladder. To access the bladder, the physician makes an incision in the skin above the pubic bone and cuts the corresponding muscles, fat, and fascia. The physician mobilizes the bladder and the major vesicle blood vessels, and incises the bladder wall to access the diseased or damaged bladder tissue. After removing the tissue, the physician inserts catheters into the bladder and urethra and sutures the bladder tissues. The physician performs a layered closure and inserts a drain tube, bringing it out through a separate stab incision in the skin. Cystectomy, partial, simple. Complicated, e.g., post-radiation, previous surgery, difficult location. With reimplantation of ureter, S, into bladder, ureteroneocystostomy. The physician brings the cut end of the ureter through a stab wound in the bladder and sutures the ureter to the bladder. Cystectomy, complete. With bilateral pelvic lymphadenectomy, including external iliac, hypogastric and obturator nodes. The physician dissects and ties, ligates, the hypogastric and vesicle vessels, and severs the bladder from the urethra, rectum, surrounding peritoneum, vas deferens, and prostate. After removing the bladder and controlling bleeding, the physician inserts drain tubes and performs a layered closure. Cystectomy, complete with ureterosigmoidostomy or ureterocutaneous transplantations. With bilateral pelvic lymphadenectomy, including external iliac, hypogastric and obturator nodes. The physician removes the bladder, cystectomy, and pelvic lymph nodes, and connects the ureters to the skin or sigmoid colon. The physician also removes external iliac, hypogastric and obturator lymph nodes. The physician dissects and ligates the hypogastric and vesicle vessels, and severs the bladder from the ureters and urethra. Blunt dissection from adherent rectum, surrounding peritoneum, and vas deferens and prostate may be needed. After controlling bleeding, the physician diverts urine by implanting the ureters to the skin, ureterocutaneous transplant, or connecting, anastomosing, the ureters to the sigmoid colon, ureterosigmoidostomy. To provide support during healing, the physician inserts a slender tube into each ureter. After completing the urinary diversion procedure, the physician inserts drain tubes and performs a layered closure. Cystectomy, complete with ureteroileal conduit or sigmoid bladder, including intestine anastomosis. With bilateral pelvic lymphadenectomy, including external iliac, hypogastric and obturator nodes. The physician removes the bladder, cystectomy, and pelvic lymph nodes, and diverts urine by connecting the ureters to a ureteroileal conduit or sigmoid bladder with an opening into the skin. The physician also removes external iliac, hypogastric, and obturator lymph nodes. The physician dissects and ligates the hypogastric and vesicle vessels, and severs the bladder from the ureters and urethra. Blunt dissection from adherent rectum, surrounding peritoneum, and vas deferens and prostate may be needed. After controlling bleeding, the physician diverts urine by connecting the ureters to a segment of ileal or sigmoid colon fashioned into a conduit or bladder, respectively, with an opening into the skin. To provide support during healing, the physician inserts a slender tube into each ureter. Cystectomy, complete, with continent diversion, any technique, using any segment of small and slash or large intestine to construct neobladder. The physician dissects and ligates the hypogastric and vesicle vessels, 
and severs the bladder from the urethra. Blunt dissection from adherent rectum, surrounding peritoneum, and vas deferens and prostate may be needed. After controlling bleeding, the physician diverts urine by connecting the ureters to a segment of large or small bowel fashioned into a bladder with an opening into the skin. To provide support during healing, the physician inserts a slender tube into each ureter. After completing the urinary diversion procedure, the physician inserts drain tubes and performs a layered closure. Ovarian cystectomy, unilateral or bilateral. Through a small abdominal incision just above the pubic hairline, the physician removes a cyst or cysts on one or both of the ovaries. Cystotomy, for simple excision of vesicle neck. The physician accesses the bladder neck and removes diseased or enlarged bladder neck tissue. The bladder is sutured and the abdominal wall is closed. Cystotomy, for excision of bladder diverticulum, single, or multiple. The physician removes a diverticulum, a herniated defect of the bladder. The physician makes an incision in the bladder and may insert a ureteral stent if the diverticulum is close to the ureter. After dissecting the diverticulum from surrounding tissues and arteries, the physician excises the defective tissue and closes the remaining musculature and mucosa with absorbable sutures. This process may be repeated in other diverticula. Cystotomy, for excision of bladder tumor. The bladder is incised, cystotomy. After removing the tumor and surrounding diseased vesicle tissue, the physician inserts a drain tube and performs a layered closure. <laughs>